Good morning. Interesting night, very windy. <laughs> kind of cool though. Nice to get a, a mountain spot in. We are back in Sweden now though. Oh, crossed back over the border yesterday because we didn't really want to go any further down in Norway because then, at least for me, I'd have to go quite a way down to then get another border crossing. And the thing you find a lot in Norway is to get from A to B, normally you have to go round C or get a ferry or something, you know, it's just how it works there. Everything's quite long when it comes to driving. And obviously, I'm on a limited budget. Connor is on limited time. So I think he's actually going to be heading off from us on Friday. It's now... What are we? There we go. Wednesday. So only a couple more park-ups uh, with him. Yeah, we thought we'd come back into Sweden and also get some cheap beer. I didn't show you on the camera, uh, but he did, so you'll have to wait for that, probably in the summer. <laughs> but um, if you're not subscribed to his Patreon, I would recommend it. I know it's more money, I know, I know not everyone can do that, but if you can, it's worth it. We thought we'd come back over here, pick up some beers and get some couple of nice wilderness park ups for the last couple of nights because yeah the beer price in Norway is astronomical I mean <laughs> I remembered it being bad from before but I couldn't I don't know if I was exaggerating in my mind or what but I wasn't it's very expensive. You're talking five quid a can, at least, <laughs> just for one can. A ten pack of Stella. There are either dumpy bottles or dumpy cans. I'm not sure. But you know the, is it 330 mil cans? And it was thirty quid <laughs> for a ten pack. <laughs> Absolutely incredible prices. It's like it's so expensive that it's just funny. You just have to laugh at it. Never gonna buy it, of course. So yeah, shopping in Norway is not the one. So if you ever go, try and stock up. Obviously, there's only so much beer and stuff that you can take in before they um, tax you on it if you get caught at the border. However, fuel though, I think I did show you. We found it cheap yesterday, but this was very weird. So, I don't know why I keep putting fuel in this. I've done it twice now. Stupidly. I don't need to. This this van could have done this entire trip just on one tank of diesel. But we kept seeing it cheap. And my mind is the same as it used to be, which is you see cheap fuel, you put it in. So, twice I've topped it up by about... I think 20 litres was the most I'd put in. But I'm not going to put any more in now. However, as we were on the way out, we went to another petrol station because it was very cheap. Cheapest fuel I've seen for quite a while. It worked out to about £1.27. So, he filled up his van on £1.27. This was, I think it was 16 something knock i went in the petrol station for a poo and then when i came out i thought bollocks it's cheap might as well fill it up because i use the van at home anyway you know so i might as well get cheap fuel put my card in as i was putting my pin in the price changed and it's a good job i flipping noticed because it jumped in the space of a minute from 16 something to 23 like <laughs> and that's like back to home price no I can't check what that is because I've got no internet 
but that's like a 50p jump in price just like that <laughs> so I pressed cancel and pulled my card out so fast I think I melted the machine yeah so that's one to watch keep an eye on the fuel price until the very last second that you put the nozzle in anyway it's all fun and games it's the kind of shit you experience isn't it when you're out and about it's very bright I think I'm gonna have to put sunglasses on sorry what a park up absolutely mental full on in the mountains in the middle of nowhere zero phone signal the only saving grace was his Starlink last night managed to get good signal on that so that reached into my van I could do some stuff you're probably thinking why do you need internet you know why do you want to use technology when you're out in a place like this and you're not wrong but at the same time park ups like this we are just parked at the side of the road there's nothing to do you know other than the beautiful view which we can enjoy as I'm doing now can't even walk anywhere because it's just full snow <laughs> so yeah sometimes technology is good and you can chill and you know get some work done or whatever anyway I'm not going to sit here waffling for ages because the video will be massive yeah once he is up and about we'll uh, formulate a plan I think there's a there's a place just down the road called is it or order I think that's how you say it I don't know a with an O on top re we're gonna go there because I think there's a shop and then we'll see I don't know try and find a cool park up
but is it good enough? That's the question. I'm getting the vibes of don't settle for this one. <laughs> it's nice, but there will be better. Hmm. Yeah, it's a bit. Yeah. I don't know. It doesn't quite tickle the pickle. No. Because like, we're on the bloody motorway, what are we doing? Yeah. Look north, well, loads. Yeah. We, I am happy to dip off and go up a bit. There's a, a lakeside spot not far off, and then, like I say, further up. What's that? Um, Black little lake. Beautiful and quiet place in the forest. <laughs> Shut. <laughs> I saw this one earlier, but I went off it because it's very well mowed and it looks a bit... Mm. Mm. Wonderful place. Get off, you dick. Ooh, that looks... Is this the one you were looking at? No, that one looks right. The one I saw literally like is... Posh mode. This is by a lake. Okay. Pictures on the paddleboard. It's great. Yeah. Ooh, that's... Is it bullshit though? Is it like a good walk to the lake? Amazing spot. Great for a swim. By a place and parking by the water. Okay. A short walk away from ancient remains. God. Uh, yeah, there. Oh, that's the one I was about to click on. Yeah. A little bit north, but not much. On road. I guess it's off this motorway, doesn't it? Yeah, this is shite. Not having much fun on there. Motorways take the path of least resistance, don't they? Yeah, path of, flat and sheep. path of least interest. Yeah. 45 minutes. Yeah, there's only half two now. It's just one road, it looks like. But there, there's a shitload in that area, I think. It's just a max fart. Max fart already? <laughs> yeah, maybe we can, like, do something like this. Yeah. And then you can get on that. Oh yeah, bloody hell, we the location. <laughs> I know. Oh. Got to string it on, let's go back. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just loop back a bit. We've barely even come out of flipping Norway. I know. No, right. You're not swimming yet. Get away. Go into another Wait. lake. This lake is not Ooh. up to our standards. And so what, I've had to resort to driving in my socks. <laughs> it's warm to bed. It? The rubber booties are not so good in the summer. Yeah, I bet. Them shoes I've got, the ones are melted. Oh my god. The sweat of the feet. My fan just stopped. Oh, oh there it is. Hey! <laughs> to my way. That's an it intermittent fault. Same. Mine, you got um, a plug that goes into the fan. And if you do that, it works. Yeah. And then you go over a bump and it stops again. Um, yeah. Carrying on. Alright, back over Thumb Wagon. Motorway, bloody horrible highway, whatever you want to call it. Back out into this stinks a little bit. Be in 
no go. Wondering what's around the corner. If we can punch through it. Yeah. I mean, you'll skip, but it's where the right seat. Oh, well, that's quite a lot. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's rock hard. Yeah. No worries. River. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest, what was the point in fitting all-terrain tyres if you're not going to drive on all-terrains? Very true, very true. I haven't tested it properly yet. That scared me. That's... oh, that's... That's not snow, though. Here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's too deep. <laughs> I'm gonna get stuck here. Yeah. Whoa. Shit, man, it's there. Yeah, that's, de <laughs> that's definitely not drivable. Nah. My van. <laughs> oh, look at the bloody view as well. Yeah. I mean, I'm tempted just to ram it on there. Trouble is, if we get stuck. We've then got to go and ask the people who've just been pissing off for the last hour. Yeah, that's true. For a tow. <laughs> Sorry about the tracks, but can you now pull us out? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah. What? Someone has stole the hut. Mental. Oh no, that's a pontoon. Oh bloody hell. Oh what a spot. And there. And we're not gonna get over there. Maybe we just do it and live here until it warms up. Yeah, stay here. That God. That's a shame. That would have been a great spot. I'll try and reverse out of here now. This is going to be interesting, I think. So I've parked on the hill. Oh, she's a beast! She's a beast! Spinning, that's not good. Let's try again. Oh, God. Okay. <clears throat> Having a little bit of trouble here. Very nearly went off the track then. That would not have been good. As it came about 10 centimetres from the edge of the track, sliding. Sliding? You need a. You alright? Yeah, I had to try three times. On my way. Damn, I saw the old uh, tow rope would be coming out then. Oh, <laughs> 
Swiggly bum. Oh, I got no words. God damn it. <laughs> Unbelievable. That was a long road as well. I don't know about you, but I want a Guinness. Same. That's it. Get the fire on and drink. Alright, where are we at? So, let's just see what happens. Beautiful place. Beautiful. What, are you going to drive on there? Back onto it. See what <laughs> How hard can it be? Van did well though. Like it was on flipping ice skates, but we made it. I don't think this is going to end well for him. But we can watch. Oh yeah. Long way back. I lost track of my lid. Oh, sketches. Track them. Although this is pretty fanciful bullshit. It works for us. We did, kind of. <laughs> we didn't go on an app at all. <laughs> <laughs> Only used Google Maps to get here. It's a little bit ropey. Yeah. Be alright. Mm. So we went from full bear grills mode to a museum. Yeah. Cool. I got a wet foot. <laughs> I just have to check. <laughs> mm. Oh. Well, there you go. That's almost pinging at your face. Yeah. Lance out. So cool, why they're just all this flat stones. Yeah. That's like Portugal buildings, isn't it? Yeah, that's how they build the walls and yeah, the buildings and the walls. An old train. Looks like it. Oh wow. He snapped a metal girder. <laughs> An iron girder. Yeah, Looks like it's gonna fall down while we're in. Yeah. All in. So uh, I think it's blast furnace it said. Yeah, I'm Isn't guessing it? this is all the roof at one point. Maybe. That's quite cool as well, the slate in between the wood. Oh bloody hell, yeah. I mean that's what is that? That'd be raw tight, isn't it? But just the whole thing, it's like, surely it's not a fire. No, it's sort of like it's... It's under a wooden it. building. Yeah. <laughs> God knows what they are. Nice. I'd live in one of them. Yeah. That was my plan, was to build something about that big. Yeah. Like get a field and build one of them. From my box. From the serious I know. That. Where would you build that in your place? Well, now, I don't know. But.
<laughs> Try the door, there's be someone in bed. <laughs> Smush it all across. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> England is here! <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Why are people taking up the whole page? I don't know. What's this? Idiots. <laughs> Great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not ideal. This is 2019. Oh, that one's 2020, 21. Ooh, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. 2019. Why would you. Yeah. Some of you didn't quite understand, did they? Oh, here we go, 22. Where? Why? Why would you do this? Perhaps someone's left their mark. Yeah. Here we go, oh. here we go. found blank pages. Sorry, 2018, get back in. Found blank? Ah. Two blank pages and a face. There you go. www.youtube.com <laughs> <laughs> And lost you yeah. <laughs> Instagram, Facebook and Did that pen come with the house? Yeah. It's not your pen Yeah, it come with the house yeah. United Office yeah. Very old mm. Shush, Is it hanging off your butt? You'd fired It's just been eaten, it's probably fine <laughs> Yeah, if anyone decides to visit this place, you can find us in the Gastbock. The Gastbock. <laughs> yes. I think we may have just achieved full virginity. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't even look like it's used. No, it looks a bit. They did say that on the ad. Dilapidated museum. Oh. Then let's cross. Mm. Oh, that's a ram. Bloody hell. Through the gate. There's another one on the other side. What a heat coming out of there.
Finally, seats next to the fire. Thank you. 